Um, my opponent is X and three, not X and two. I've I've played against everyone at the top of the standing, so I got paired down. Um, against cycling, Judith is good. It's good to ping their creatures. Woe Strider is good to chump block. If I draw a cat or devil, this hand is good. I'm not sure if I should keep or not. I think that I'll keep. A bit of a speculative keep. Obosh is good with my Judith, and I have almost all the lands I need. Okay, I'm glad to see no fox turn one. Okay, now I'm put to the test. Should I cast Judith and just sack and trade or play Woe Strider and then I think that I should just sack the Judith. Judith doesn't work like Mayhem Devil. I can't just sack the token to kill the rescuer. There's a fox. Can't cast two spells no matter what I do, so let's just play this Woe Strider. I may or may not jump block. We'll see. Probably will. They can get back this trample card eventually, so I probably do want to jump. Do you have to decide whether I'd rather scry or get a food? I'd probably rather scry. Claim the firstborn would be such a good draw here. Five cards in the graveyard. All right, they're just gonna give trample now. Bit surprising. If I don't block and sack, then they can cycle. It would be good to concede, but I think that my matchup against this particular version is not that good relative to my other matchups, which are also good. This person has a bunch of pro black creatures in their deck. Just looking for claim, basically. Okay, so I could play Obosh and attack. They'll almost certainly block. So they could play Luris in one of their two drops, but they'll probably just cycle. They have five cards for Zenith Flare.
They probably want to cast the Zenith Slayer this turn. So let's see if they're able to use any more mana. Okay, so this is 10. If I sack, they can deal maximum of 14. Fine with that. I mean, I'm threatening lethal if I find a claim. Let's see. Yeah, that doesn't do me any good. And I'm of course threatening lethal if they don't play a blocker. Oh, okay, I see. All right, well I can still find claim, I believe. Not really close to escaping. I'm dead to Zenith Flare, and I need to block both creatures. It's definitely not good for me. But yeah, claim would have been lethal. I mean, I guess I'll just block, but I'm gonna I'm gonna lose the flare almost assuredly. So in their sideboard, they have three cage, may or may not bring that in, two devout decree, and three apostle. So I need to be able to kill the apostle. That's a maybe for me. That's good. That's good. And I want some amount of drill bit. I'm gonna take out the Cavalier because I'm also taking out my banners. So I won't be able to cast a five drop that often. Okay, I need to draw lands and sack outlets. But my hand has a lot of potential.
So I could threaten a triple block, but I don't really want to. Just going to go for the kill. Try to kill them before they can get all set up. Okay, that is very, very annoying. So I could suicide one of my creatures for five damage. Doesn't seem worth it right now. Hello, Zach attack. The Pro Tours are not gonna be small after this quarantine is over, they've been running PTQs the whole time and they haven't been running PTs, so something's going to happen to the size of these PTs. I, for I guess I forgot about Go for Blood. I thought that they had no removal in their deck. Yeah, there's no seeding in this tournament. I could have dealt one to the Fox, but their deck is all cycling cards. What are they going to have? All right, let's get the squads out of my deck. Then I guess we'll play Obosh if I can, and then eventually we'll gear up for a big turn. Okay, let's say that I just steal their two big creatures. Attack, they eat one, take eight. That's not nearly enough. This was one of the worst draws in my deck. Like a land, I can play Obosh, and then three drop would actually be good. I did take the banners out of my deck, so it's harder for me to be aggressive. I need Active Treason because they have these protection from black cards in their deck. Okay, I'm probably going to go for Jude at the claim. Just a question of whether I should steal. I should probably steal the pro black card rather than the Luris. If they want to trade the Luris, that's fine. Yeah, I, I guess I didn't realize that. I definitely would have taken that trade. That was my mistake. Missed out on a lot of damage early on, turn three.
Okay, they just took all the damage. We'll see if they can kill me on the backswing. They can Zenith Slayer for 3, they'll put me to 10. I think if they have cycling card into Zenith Flare, then I will die. Okay, um, I did make a mistake that game by not attacking. <laughs>